The cement tiles, couleur et matière, 15 mm thick, are tinted in the mass. Manufactured by hand in a traditional way, the decorative surface is made up of a mixture of tinted cement and marble powder, a thickness from 3 to 4 mm. Due to the unique treatment of the tiles, follow the instructions carefully to ensure proper installation and longer life. Gluing Apply the adhesive with a comb or spatula with broad square teeth, 6 to 9 mm, depending on the irregularity of the support. To facilitate the leveling of the surface, we recommend you apply glue to tiles as well as the floor. Remove excess glue on the sides to prevent glue from getting in between the tiles. Position and set the tiles only with strong pressure of the hand. Remove any excess adhesive between the tiles with finger. The tiles should be placed with 1 to 2 mm apart, i.e. the thickness of your spatula. Continue the installation with care, making sure each tile is placed properly. Do not strike the tiles with a mallet, as this may cause microcracks. Never soak them during gluing. Wait 48 hours before making the joints. Joints Prepare a liquid barbotine of hydrofuge cement joint. Mix liquid until the final consistency is as thick as soft butter. Before pouring the barbotine, it is necessary to wet your tiles with clear water. This humidifies the tiles and facilitates the sealing of the joint. Your barbotine is ready. Using a rubber spatula, spread your mixture on the tiles by small surfaces. Apply pressure to the joints to fill them with barbotine in order to fill the entire space between tiles. Scrape to remove the barbotine surplus and re-wetting the surface if needed. Finish the smoothing of the joints with a dried sponge. After a few minutes, the surface starts to bleach. Clean again with a dried sponge by controlling the smoothing and joint sealing to the finger if needed. As soon as the surface becomes powdery, scrub vigorously with a dry cloth which will polish the tiles and the joints. Last finishes. The day after the pouring of the joints, you must check that there are no remaining cement traces on the tiles. If found, remove with abrasive sandpaper and water. Choose a fine grain. In case of accidents, such as footprints, use the same abrasive paper with water. Finish cleaning by using a standard abrasive type Scotch-Brite by hand or, for larger surfaces, a single brush machine. And finally, clean with a microfiber rag to absorb the remaining liquid. It is necessary to wait two to four weeks before applying the final treatment, as surface should be perfectly clean and dry. Treatment. The treatment product must be applied in several fine layers. Use an adapted roller and wipe the surplus after each application. Repeat until saturation. The above instructions adapted specifically to our cement tiles, have been presented to you by Couleur et Matière.